Hey babes, welcome back to another vlog. We are here in Houston and um, I'm here for work, it's work travel. Um, I'm just gonna freshen up my makeup and go to my first meeting, which is not until noon. It's about, let's see what time it is right now. It is 1027 right now. Um, in Atlanta, it's 1127. Y'all know it's an hour behind time at home. So I just wanted to freshen up my makeup. I didn't put, well, really apply some of my makeup. I haven't put any makeup on um, because my flight left so early this morning. So I'm just going to show y'all kind of what I use, what I do. So the first thing that I did was I did kind of do a wash. I washed my face um, just because through the airport, germs, all that. So I'm just kind of start with the clean slate. Um, I'm going to start with my hourglass. Y'all know this is my go-to. So I'm just going to start with this and um, just apply this to my face for some moisture. Um, it's basically just a serum and we're going to bring it down to our neck. But this is the first thing that I put on when I go to apply makeup. I'm a clean makeup girl so I don't use um, a lot of makeup. I don't use foundation. I don't use all any of that stuff because um, I'm just like if it, if it ain't broke don't fix it. You know my skin is very sensitive so um, I don't want to add any layers of nothing that's going to make my skin break out. Um, and my skin has always been sensitive, so I've always been that person that does not really use too much stuff on my face. Next, I'm going in with my Super Goop Bright Eye Cream. And I actually, believe it or not, I think I told y'all this before, I use this as a concealer. And I'm about to show y'all how good it works. So y'all see my eyes right now. So I will just, I'll put it on my fingers here and I'll rub my two fingers together like that like so like that um and then i just kind of i don't rub it all the way in so you see how it leaves like this white hue um not necessarily white but it's like a um it's tinted so i like to put this on and it basically for me it gives me the same effect as concealer does for me so i don't have um dark circles under my eyes. I don't have any of that. I'll kind of bring it down my nose just to kind of blend it in a little bit. Um, but I don't blend it all the way in. I kind of leave it a little there, you know, um, if that makes sense for y'all. Then I will go in with my Fenty Invisimat. It's just like a translucent powder. I will go take this and then I'll go under my eye like that, which is what I would do when I did concealer. I would use um, MAC, um, it was a translucent powder and I would kind of put that under there so it wouldn't leave the creases. Um, so this gives me the same effect and it's a Vin Invisimat so it leaves your skin this super, super um, flawless, almost like you know how the Instagram filters do? Leave your skin looking flawless. Um, it covers up your pores. So that's why I really like this product. And it doesn't leave a white cast on your face. So um, that's why I love the Fenty Invisimat by Fenty Beauty. It's, it's the bomb.com. Then I will go in with my bronzer. And I use Hourglass. Um, I don't know what color this is that I use, but this is the only color that I will use on my face. Um, I don't use anything else, but this is like the last thing that I use. I use this as eyeshadow. I use this as blush. I use it as a highlighter. I use it as everything. Um, and I'll just use this type of brush. I don't know what this type of brush is called. I'm not a makeup girl, so... Um, and I don't even know what brand this is. It's so old. But I'll just dip my, kind of pat that like that. I don't even knock it off any extra. And I just smile so that I can see my little cheeks. And I'll apply it and go up. Apply it and go up. Apply it and go up. Instead of rubbing it on, 
no, I don't do that. I just dab and dab up. And then I'm going to go to this side. Dab and dab up. And I'm smiling so I can see where my cheeks are. And that's all that I do there. And then here, I kind of dab there. I'll do a little rub here. Leaves a shadow, I guess. I don't know. And then I'll just dab around here, around the top. But that's pretty much my color. And then I'll put it on the top of my eyes too, just to give me a little bit more color. Um, but yeah, that's what I do there. That's how I do that. I'll do, we'll go kind of down my T-zone area that way, you know. And of course, dabbing back there. I get my neck just so it blends in. And that's all guys that's all i use for my color and then this is my favorite uh, mascara i stopped using lashes y'all because it was just becoming a headache having to always go um every three weeks i was going once every three weeks it got expensive and you know what i'm all about minimal having a minimal lifestyle saving money not spending my money on unnecessary things um and i felt like lashes was unnecessary i didn't really need them um and you'll see here how my lashes look they don't look like nothing but when i use this or any really mascara this is just one of my faves by ysl beauty um you will see how my eyelashes will pop and y'all probably gonna be like girl why you needed some lashes anyway honey um and i didn't um i just liked them a little bit longer but this does exactly what i needed to do so i am sticking with it now maybe special occasions y'all might see me put some lashes on but i had lashes on for a few months now just because i I don't need it. Um, this is my go-to. And I will link everything below. I think I have before, but I'll go ahead and link it for y'all again if y'all interested in my makeup routine. It's very minimal, very clean girl. Um, you know, I've just, like I said, I've never been the girl that's been into makeup. Um, it's just never been me. So... I've always just kind of used bronzer and just natural, natural type products. So I've stuck with it and I'm in my 40s. So like I said, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. So y'all will see how my eyelashes are popping. Yes, honey. Yes, girl. So you see, I really don't need lashes. My lashes that I have is just fine. Um, I was going to clean up my brows a little bit. I have this. Sometimes this work and sometimes it don't work. I just got this from Target. I think it was 20 bucks, $19.99, something like that. Um, and the battery about to go dead. Or is it neat? And I'll just clean up. Y'all know I did um, microblading on my eyebrows. It's been over a year and they still look really, really good. Um, but I'll just clean up underneath here. I don't even know if that's cleaning up good, but it makes me feel like it. And I just pull my skin tight and I just go under. And that's all in between there. And that's really all I do, y'all. And then, of course, I love my Laneige. Laneige, Laneige, whatever y'all want to call it. Um, I love this. It's a... It's a lip mask that I guess you're supposed to use at night, but why only moisturize your lips at night? Moisturize them throughout the day too. So this is my go-to. I have one that I keep in my makeup bag for traveling. And then I also keep one stashed in my purse just to apply while I'm out and about. And then also, y'all already know, I think I showed y'all this before too. This is my favorite lipstick by YSL Beauty. If you have not tried it, tried it. It is so buttery soft. I'm going to show y'all. It's so uh, buttery soft. And it's a natural color. 
so I like that. It's not too pink and it's not too pale. It gives your lips a little bit of kiss, kissable type look. Um, so I love that. But yeah, I'm gonna put a little bit more of this on. I didn't dip it. This is just whatever's left over on the brush. So yeah, that is my makeup routine, guys. That's all I do. It took me, what, 10 minutes, 15 minutes, if that. I don't think it took me 15 minutes. Um, so I am going to go ahead and get my work bag together. I'm going to go downstairs and wait. Um, my first lunch meeting is at noon. So I still have some time. So I'm just going to go down downstairs in the lobby and I'm just going to connect and do some work and then I'll head out probably about 11:30 ish but let me know guys if you like my makeup routine or if you even try it let me know I like to see what you think you know I just like basic natural that's that's my aura right now I, I, I don't want to be um doing too much you know so I'm just liking that basic minimal that's, that's just what I'm feeling right now. So, um, but I will check back in with y'all later.